There are major developments tonight in the investigation into Russian interference in the presidential campaign. President Trump's former campaign manager and his deputy have pleaded not guilty to a host of charges. In the meantime, a former campaign advisor to the president has pleaded guilty to lying to the FBI. Did you commit a crime? President Trump's former campaign chairman Paul Manafort pleaded not guilty on all counts this afternoon to federal charges, including conspiracy against the United States. There is no evidence that Mr. Manafort or the Trump campaign colluded with the Russian government. Manafort and his former business partner Rick Gates are facing 12 felony counts. The indictment alleges Manafort and Gates hid their work as agents of the Ukrainian government and covered up millions of dollars in offshore accounts. President Trump reacted on Twitter saying this is years ago before Paul Manafort was part of the Trump campaign and added there is no collusion. Special counsel Robert Mueller's team also revealed today a guilty plea from a former Trump campaign advisor. It marks the first criminal count that directly connects the Trump campaign to Russian intermediaries. In a plea deal, George Papadopoulos, who worked on the campaign as a foreign policy advisor, admitted to lying to federal agents about his dealings with several Russians who offered dirt on Mr. Trump's rival, Hillary Clinton. According to his plea agreement, at one point in time, he told campaign officials about his contacts with Russians and someone, it's not identified in the indictment, but someone wrote back to him in an email, great work. It has nothing to do with the activities of the campaign. It has to do with his failure to tell the truth. The White House says it expects the special counsel's investigation to wrap up soon. Manafort and Gates face decades in federal pr prison and millions of dollars in fines if convicted on all charges. Now a little more background on Paul Manafort. He was the Trump campaign manager from May to August of 2016. He was also a former top advisor to the pro-Russian Ukrainian president and served as a lobbyist for international leaders and dictators since the 70s. Rick Gates was President Trump's deputy campaign chairman. He also served as a former Trump campaign aide and was a business associate of Manafort's since the mid-2000s. George Papadopoulos was a member of the campaign's foreign policy team. Trump aides say he played a limited role and had no access to candidate or President Trump, but CBS News reports Papadopoulos can be seen in a national security meeting within candidate Trump in an Instagram post from Trump.